Hello everyone, in this demo I'm going to show you how to set up a Hikvision camera with the CamCloud service. So first thing you need to do is log in to camcloud.com and go to the cameras page. And this is a list of existing cameras that I've already set up with CamCloud. Now click on add camera to start the camera wizard. For a Hikvision camera, select generic H.264 and call it whatever you want. And before you continue, make sure you know what your camera's RTSP URL is. Um, so click on next. Put in your information here. In our case, your username is admin. And our RTSP port is 3039. So for the network setup, use the camera's username and password. Make sure you use your camera's password, not your CamCloud password. Uh, this is your external IP address here. And this is where you want to provide your RTSP port so, so that we can pull video from the camera. Then the RTSP path. In the case of Hikvision cameras, it's slash video dot H264. I just took a look at the documentation from Hikvision, and this is what the T RTSP URL looked like. If you're not sure about what yours is, just contact support at campcloud.com and we'll answer that question for you. Then click on next. And if it goes through, that means we were successful and able to ping the camera so the network setup is complete. Just a little note here before we continue. When we first pop up the dialog to enter your FTP credentials, we say ftp.camcloud.com is what you should use. But that doesn't work for Hikvision cameras. So what you want to do is enter an IP. So ftp.camcloud.com doesn't work on some models of Hikvision. You'll have to use an FTP IP and you can get that by contacting support at camcloud.com. So what we're going to do next is go to the Hikvision camera interface and what they want is your FTP credentials which you can find right here. So let's head over to the Hikvision camera interface. So once you're logged into this page, go to the configuration tab here, then under advanced configuration, click on network and then click on FTP over here. So what they want here is your FTP credentials. That's where you want to put your username and your password and for some reason it doesn't allow you to copy and paste the password in, just something to keep in mind. And make sure the upload picture button at the bottom over here is checked. Now click on test. If the testing is successful, it means you've configured with FTP correctly, which is great. So in this case, it was successful. Now jump to events over here. Make sure your motion detection is enabled and that you have a motion detection area selected. So right now it's enabled. Then down here you have something called a linkage method. That makes sure FTP is being uploaded. Make sure you check the upload to FTP box over here. Now the last step is to jump to storage. Click on the snapshot tab here. And make sure you check on the enable event triggered snapshot checkbox. And that's it. Do this and you'll be set up and ready to use cloud storage with CamCloud and your Hikvision camera. Now when there is motion in front of the camera, you'll be able to see what kind of motion activity was captured by the device. So if you have any questions, contact us at support at and that's the end of the demo. Until next time.